wanted to come by my home here than uh, uh, things that, you know, just to look and see what has been posted online. Here's some things you might want to check out. On the west side of my property there, you can see back over here is what I call the left leftover man-sized piece of tunnel pipe. And uh, sitting over there at the corner of the fence, the neighbor that lives there, she told me it just showed up one day, of course, before I moved in. And I think that would be perfect for uh, underground access, specifically to where the two side-by-side -side manholes are on the other side of the... Uh, of the dividing wall back there next to the secluded truck unloading lane behind Home Depot. Okay, I'll show you another thing. I don't know if I can get this on video. I said this before. See, if you can see here where I'm touching the, this, uh, the whole home is buried, the entire property is buried under about a foot and a half of dirt. And, and that's odd in itself. That's in a video called 28 Layers right here buried center blocks seems to be in line with what looked like a ditch was cut in the backyard going directly over to see where that telephone pole is there's a missing tree the two side-by-side -side manholes are on the other side of the wall of the Home Depot so if you drive down there you can see that and recently it looks like somebody marked marks on the curb there where I wondered if they weren't marking the tunnel location but so you can see that I'm gonna pause this we'll go around back Okay, I'm going on on the back side right here. This is Bella. She's she's the burglar dog. She's a super dog. And and there's not really a lot to see other here. You can see where my my camera's on the corner of the house. I'll show you what that looks like. And, and this is where I take pictures. Of, well, you know, and uh, uh, watching the property best I can. Anyway, coming down that alley on the other side of that wall, you can see how it. Uh, how it's secluded back there in that trucking lane and uh and that's where you used to see uh trucks show up 24 7 and the afternoons they would be lined up up here nobody would be unloading any freight of course that doesn't really happen anymore now that that tree's been taken out and, and i'll show you that see all these lines of trees if you look there's a missing tree right there okay right there with that telephone pole and you see that wire that's hanging off that telephone pole that's a coax sudden link coax that goes into the pipe into the ground and and suddenly couldn't tell me where it goes actually they said it went to the home depot the home depot said it didn't go over there they were adamant that it didn't and we know it doesn't go to the houses so we have a underground cable internet that that's just mystery it's been there all along and it's right next on the where them two side-by-side -side manholes are and i've got videos of them and uh, uh, but it looks like 2014 2015 possibly that was a cover-up there's an old aerial satellite map that looks like there was a a um, a ditch cut in this yard and when you extend that ditch out it would connect up with this west manhole over here and it would connect up with the the bricks right there you know so we wondered if it wasn't coming in here that using that some of that tunnel pipe that give them access into this house of course they're only in the attic when i wasn't here and i was gone most of the time working and uh up until you know they shot me and tried to kill me and, and then uh then i was disabled um i'm gonna try to show you on the other side of this fence and uh, uh, let me pause this real quick okay I'm gonna go out the, the end of the alley here and you can see it that's the end of Whittle Way if you take Whittle Way it ends right there and at night time that's where you see the lights it's right out of the view of the camera if you drive down this alley like I said you come over and look sometime check out this wall right here and what you're gonna see is a row of bricks is missing and concrete was poured in here starting right here where, where them bricks are stacked up and you can see it here all over here here it looks like when they're digging it out they they hit the telephone pole with the backhoe while they was digging their the murder tunnel their sex traffic and murder tunnel and then we go here and we look right here and, and, and you'll see it ends right there in the middle of the support column. Okay, that's not a stepping because you'd never start in the middle of the support column. You can literally see there's a row of bricks missing. In the backyard of this home, there's a pile of bricks, right? And I asked her, uh, red bricks, and I asked her where they come from. She said, oh, that fence out there. And I wonder if it's not that these bricks that are missing here. So I wonder if this one dug under provide tunnel access and, um, there was a person at Home Depot uh, I was telling my story to 
and she told me one time you ever see a lot of cars parked out front at night it's because we're stalking you know and uh i hadn't seen that but was told a lot of people were here on the night i shot and of course multiple people said underground facilities here and so uh, i wondered if they weren't going into home depot and that was the excuse oh we're stalking they're going underground and they're coming through the tunnel over here you know that's one theory of, of uh what's going on here this is the telephone pole up there that's a sudden link cable right there and we'll just trace that down and we'll see it goes into a pipe goes into the ground okay and like i said sudden link says oh that goes home depot home depot says no way we have sudden link coming into our our uh, our building you know and uh, and i went up several layers of management and so this little shed right here you remember the video i made where the the digging noise was coming from under the ground it was right on the other side of that shed and in the backyard of this house was that thing covering the ground that looked like suspected tunnel entrance it was taken out the same time as this tree live tree was taken out right here and right on the other side of that fence is in west manholes i've literally got pictures of trucks parked right here when the loading door is down here on this side or on the other side and so come on by and check it out and take you some pictures and post it i mean this this is the real deal here somebody rigged this home i'm you know i believe uh, I had these trucks were showing up 24 7 it looks like sex trafficking was going on people in the attic looks like they're coming down servicing the truckers going back up and it's like a truck stop like lot lizards and and you know much of that stopped now that you know they tried to murder me and and uh, and i lived and then them uh them cops got caught sneaking in my house and still in the evidence but anyway at midland texas 3802 fair circle right behind the home depot store y'all have a good day